Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to enable the new widget settings menu from Windows 11 on the dev channel. So for those of you who don't know, Microsoft added a new widget settings menu on the dev channel, which you can access by clicking your profile slash settings button. And from there, you have a few options, one of them being the most wanted option to disable the open widgets board on hover. So you will be able to disable that once you enable the new widget settings menu. That new widget settings menu is only rolled out to a limited number of Windows Insiders, but thanks to Phantom Ocean 3 on Twitter, we have the command to enable that with Vive Tools. So as a thanks to Phantom Ocean 3, please go ahead and follow him on Twitter because he deserves a follow. So before showing you how to enable the new widget settings menu, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. As I've said, you'll need to be on build 25,000 at least or later because this is only rolled out to a few insiders since a few builds in the dev channel so you'll need to be on a later build on the dev channel at least and next up of course you're going to, need to download vive tool which is a tool that helps us enable different hidden features in windows 11 you're going to have the download link in the article below in the description just download the latest version zip open up the downloaded archive and then click on extract all and here browse for the system 32 location that would be this pc local lisk c windows and then scroll down to system 32 and select it. Click on select folder and then click on extract. In my case, I'm going to have to replace the files at the destination because I already did this. Click on continue a few times and you should be good to go. Vive tool should be completely and successfully set up on your computer. Now, what you'll need to do is to open the search box, type in there CMD and run CMD as administrator by clicking on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. In CMD, you're going to have to paste in at least one command. You'll be able to find both commands in the article below in the video's description the first link. The first one is the command that will enable the widget settings menu. You should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. But the second command is for notification badging. If you don't have that enabled, there's also a setting in the widget settings menu that has to do with, with the notification badging. So if you don't have that enabled, you can just run the second command as well. And after you did all this, you can close out everything and you'll need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Only that will enable the new widget settings menu. So I'm going to restart my computer and come back again. And now after the restart, if you click on the widgets board button and then click on your profile or the settings button, you're going to have this new widget taskbar settings. So first of all, we have the most wanted option, show widgets on hover, see widgets pane while hovering on the taskbar. You can disable this and if you disable it, once you hover over the widgets pane, it will no longer open the board when you hover over. That is really nice. We also have show widgets badging, see widgets notification on the, on the taskbar. I also saw a lot of people that wanted this to be disabled, can now disable it from here, and also show widget rotation, see updates from widgets on the taskbar, can leave this on. In my opinion, for me, I'm just gonna disable show widgets on hover, and the other settings will be left on enabled. So this is how you enable the new widget settings menu on Windows 11 on the dev channel. It's really simple, the commands will be in the article below in the description, so you can get them from there. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like below, and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated, so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.